Hello everyone, we made it to vlog 3. Um, so just quickly, uh, challenges that I feel we had for this assignment would probably be the main thing would be scheduling when we would all be able to meet up to go over um, the purpose of our assignment. So for Allison, we were focusing on helping her work on her balance and on her uh, strength and her flexibility for her. We were doing like a mini prescription exercise prescription program for her um the hardest part was being able to schedule when to meet up and everything because we all have we all work and we all have school so it was just trying to find a day where we would all be able to meet up versus only having one or two people meet up with allison and we even had instances where um, we even had to cancel an appointment day because something came up for allison and i did mention that in my previous video as well so i think that would be the number one challenge that we had um we didn't have any communication challenges whatsoever everything was so smooth we would text each other we'd always um be up to date on if we would be able to meet if somebody was running late or etc etc so no problems with any communication um i don't feel that we had any limitations for our assignment um everything was pretty pretty easy to do we would like say we would be able to communicate super easy with each other we were like texting the whole time um is in regards to the assignment um i think what we were required to do for the assignment we did be able we were able to um satisfy those goals so no no limitations whatsoever for for working with allison and um i think in regards to working with Allison for uh, working with her in the future, I probably don't see that as happening just because she has mentioned before that she does want to be uh, working more than she is now because she does want to be a, um, a counselor for couples, a therapy counselor for couples, so she would be having less and less time available to be able to meet up with us and work with us, so there probably wouldn't be any further uh, involvement with our group on her behalf not because she didn't want to just because she just wouldn't have the time for us as um because of she wants to be working a little bit more and then um aspirations or my career aspirations are working with older adults and being able to um help them in their functional fitness i had mentioned in my previous videos as well um i think that Working with Allison has helped me be more comfortable with her as it was part of like one of my three goals also that I said that I wanted to hit um, while I did this assignment. I do feel that I'm able to communicate with them a little bit better, that I am able to uh, simplify, I guess simplify what the purpose of certain things are since we uh, we were working for her uh, for her fitness. It, it did help me um, a be able to explain further the movements and give a uh, an example that they're able to follow so for example if i wanted her to squat and she wasn't able to do it properly like, oh, like just think of like if you're sitting on a chair or something or if you're getting up from a chair and it just helped me be able to express exactly what i'm looking for a lot easier and be able to talk to them and communicate just in general like um that definitely um was hit and was worked on uh while i was working with allison um, and other than that, I think the, this, this assignment, this project, this assignment was really great. Like I said, I got to work with somebody who is not my age group. So it got, it gave me the chance to see how she, uh, would respond to certain things or how she would comment on certain things versus how we would do it. Um, which I thought was really great and just like an eye opener in general. Um, so yeah, that's the end of my vlog.